the zoo. Brought to you by EBS. It's half seven in the morning, and zoo staff are gearing up for another busy day. We're going to weigh our uh, Sumatran tiger cubs that were born last week. Well, that's a pretty impressive way for a little one, isn't it? Just notice that the female of the two cubs she seems to be you know, kind of hyperventilating a little bit more than the male. Last August, we started reporting that you could see some abnormal growth on her hooves. It's absolutely imperative that we get this sorted out. Just give her the antecedent, please. The, the outcome has to be that she walks out the other side. I've been working in the zoo since 1996. Like, I wanted to be a zookeeper since it was early because I remember. That's a nice bit of pee in my head there. 20 minutes into the day, officially today, and yeah, you get urine on your face. So that's kind of typical of the job. One, two, three. Oh my God. We just, the next few days, we'll uh, just monitor very closely, uh, give her a few soft foods, like we're going to boil some uh, broccoli, some cauliflower, and just basically spoil her for the next few days. As you can see, there's some females out on the islands with some swollen bums. This is a sign that they're ready to mate. The bum swells up and becomes quite pink or even red and it's quite attractive to the males who like big bums. So they're going to get stuck in on the females as soon as possible and if there's a follicle ready to rupture in either of the females then they'll be able to use some of the sperm straight away which is just amazing. Imagine if we got our pregnant in one go, you know, it'd be out of this world. You know, the, there's a great bond between the keepers and the elephants and you can see it firsthand here. And again, this really is the Hilton Hotel for elephants as you can see here. At around 12 o'clock, the first foot could be seen. We're trying to keep it quiet for her, but it is very hard to contain the excitement. The bond that you build with the animals is remarkable as well. Again, it's not just a matter of just walking in and working with animals. You have to trust them and they have to trust you as well. And the rewards you get from that are second to none. You do, Grant. Promise you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Quite happily. <laughs> the joys of being a zookeeper. It's been an extremely exciting year. There's been some very bad lows and there's been some very great highs and thankfully this is one of the really good highs. Yeah, it was uh, you know, a busy morning, another eventful morning in the, in the life of the zoo, but you know, it's worthwhile. These are the things that you need to check out. It's a good morning's work all in all. Welcome to the zoo. The Zoo, brought to you by EBS.